Example two, use the gradient intercept method to sketch the graph of y equals negative 3x plus 1. So what we'll do is we'll put the gradient intercept formula above it, y equals mx plus b. And after do doing that, we can see what m equals and we can see what b equals. m is equal to negative 3, m being our gradient. and b equal to 1, which is our y-intercept. Okay, now, um, just like last time, we are going to start by labeling the y-intercept. So we put our b value down first. And then we're going to look at the gradient. Now this time the gradient's negative 3. It's not a positive number. And all that means is when you go across one, instead of going up three, you just go down three. So one, two, three, across one, one, two, three, and so on. And if you were to go in reverse, because we're supposed to be going across one, down three, if we go back one, we'd go up three, back one, up three. Okay, so quite easily we can now put our straight line in there to pass through these points. And, yep, and we'll put an arrow at each end, and, that's, and then that'll be done. 